Hey friends, let's take a look at how I have adapted my Prius V, which is a Prius station wagon, to go camping. So first thing I've done is, just like my prior Prius, added these rain guards so I can make windows cracked even if it's raining outside. I have got a GPS, thanks to my wonderful husband at Christmas, um, because I often travel in places like here where there is not um, cell service and the GPS runs off of satellites rather than cell towers. So that'll keep me um, oriented even if I don't have a cell signal. I also have a paper map um, atlas which I recommend as well. I've got a little pica here keeping me company. Uh, just like prior Prius, I've got my inverter um, so I can charge things, my cup that will heat water for me. Um, here's all my cooking stuff, my camp stoves in there, as well as my Hot Logic mini oven that plugs into the inverter. Um, I got my plastic bins out of the way that I have some of my food in but I have my cooler here, which I've been traveling for a couple of weeks now, so I don't really have any cold food left. Um, but here are some examples of delicious things that you can eat while camping that don't require refrigeration. I still have my table that hooks onto the desk. I mean, hooks onto, hooks onto the dashboard. And this car has more storage space than I know what to do with. Um, it's definitely got more room than regular Prius, and it has a couple more sleeping options. So this looks pretty much like my setup that I had in my other Prius. But one of the things that's interesting on this one is rather than folding down the seat in the back and sleeping like this, you also have the option of leaning the back seat all the way down, or I'm sorry, leaning the front seat all the way down, moving it all the way forward. Okay, so normally you would take the headrest off. I'm not because I've got stuff attached to that headrest cover, but you'd remove the headrest cover and you have about 60 inches or so of sleeping space. So um, a nice thing about that is you can use the heated seats to stay warm if you like. For me, I'm 5'10", it was just a little short for me, but if I was a smaller person, I would consider something like that. So there's another view of it. Um, let's see, I've got more storage space under here, which I'm not even really utilizing. Um, I've got my seat organizer which has now collapsed because I put the seat down, but normally that would be holding my bear spray, my keys, all that stuff. Coming around to the back. Um, it's my clothes, toiletries, bathroom stuff, and again, just more storage space than I'm actually needing. Um, the basement storage area, not quite as big as in the previous Prius, but still plenty for my needs. Oh, I installed, these are battery operated fairy lights. They just tuck right into the headliner. So those are nice. So the bed here doesn't lie quite as flat as in the, um, my earlier Prius. So what I've done to kind of raise the lower part of it is I stuck a sleeping bag there just to get some additional inches underneath. There's also kind of a gap here, which I have 
filled in with. That's just my pop-up tent that I sometimes use for changing clothes and bathroom stuff. I don't have it set up this time because I scored a campsite next to the restroom. But um, so that's what I've done to help level it out. Plus, I'm sort of parked, so I'm slightly pointed downhill. So that evens out my sleeping surface. And just like in my prior Prius, I have built the drawbridge to bridge the gap between the, the space down here between the um, back seat and the front seat. And again, you can see I could put a lot more storage in there than I actually am. So, oh, another feature I forgot to show you. This car has an additional 12 volt outlet here. So I could plug something else in, I could plug another inverter in and use that to charge stuff as well. So um, one of my favorite things about the car is the moon roof. So when I'm sleeping, I can look up and see stars. So um, I encourage you to um, watch my other videos for more details about Prius climate control and storage options and um, window coverings as well. Right now I have, that's a screen window covering and that is Hello. that one. I'm not meaning to bother you. Oh, just one minute. <laughs> You're on the phone. Okay. Yeah, just a sec. Friendly camper. So um, that's all I've got and thank you for watching.